What's up, HasFit Tribe? It's your personal trainer, Coach Kozak. And I'm Claudia, and this is a dumbbell arm workout. Today's routine is going to use multiple muscle building techniques that require you to have at least two pairs of dumbbells. You're going to want one heavier and one lighter pair so that you can switch up your weight as needed. Throughout today's routine, I will be providing some easier modifications. If you're ready to go, then let's get started. We're gonna get started with a bicep superset and we're gonna do two rounds of it. Our first move is gonna be a dumbbell curl and we're gonna perform 12 repetitions. So go ahead and grab the appropriate weight for you today. We're gonna have our feet shoulder width apart, shoulders are back, good posture. We're gonna have your palms facing forward. Now in a controlled fashion, go ahead and curl all the way up and all the way down. Performing 12 repetitions in total I really want you to also focus on controlling that descent, that lowering portion of the lift is just as important as the way up, especially in these strength training and muscle building routines. Making sure to breathe and we're inhaling on the way down, exhaling on the way up. Excellent, we're gonna burn these biceps out, the superset here is just the first move. Shoulders stay back, good posture. Three more. Almost done with these 12. Nice work, here we go, last two. And last one, all the way up. And then now let's come down until we get to those elbows 90 degrees and we're gonna pulse right here at that 90 degree elbow flexion. Just little pulses for 15 seconds. That's it, feel that burn. Already feeling it working on this first one. And three, two, one. Now we're gonna hold, don't move, don't drop those arms, just hold in that position right there for 15 seconds. We're burning right there with you, getting that lactic acid going. Not much longer, five more seconds. Come on, hold it tough, hold it tough. Three, two, one, zero. Whoo, way to get it started. All right, set those dumbbells down. Shake your arms out. We're gonna go through that sequence one more time. 15 second break here, so that break's gonna go by fast. That was awesome. That was good, she liked it. If you're unable to control the movement up and down on the bicep curl, you might be using a little bit too much weight. Feel free to mix it up if you need to. That's right, drop right. the weight if you need to. Here we go. Three, two, one, begin. Palms are up, on the way up and on the way down. Again, nice and controlled. You definitely don't want to be swinging to get the dumbbells up to yeah, your shoulders. Yeah, we don't want to use momentum on this one. Really want those muscles to work. We don't want your joints and uh, cartilage, ligaments, tendons, etc., to all take over. Good. Again, maintaining proper form, proper posture. You are halfway through. That's it. Come on. Stay tough, everybody. Six more. We're gonna feel a lot of lactic acid today. That's that burning sensation. You gotta remember, that's just that fuel that your muscles are using. And it creates that nerve response, that burn. But you're stronger than that burn. You can push past it right here. Two more. There we go. Feeling good, my arms are feeling great already. Last one, all the way up. And let's bring them down to 90 right here. Boom. 15 seconds, hold 15 it. 15 seconds on the pulse. There it is, come on. Good, just little one to two inch range of motions. Trust us, we're smiling, but our arms are burning too. Come on. Three, two, one, and hold. hold. That's it. Whew. Only two sets of these, so this is it right here. Keep fighting, everybody. Come on. Fight through that burn. We're almost there. It'll be worth it. Go to your happy place. That's Five it. more seconds. Almost there, almost there. Three, two, one, and break. Whew, excellent. And for our next superset, now it's time to go after those triceps. Similar system to the first time, we're gonna start with a lying tricep extension for 12 repetitions, finding an appropriate weight. 
down flat on our backs with our dumbbells. And if you have a bench, you can probably pull yeah. that out for these. A bench or a stability ball, you could also use it for these. We're just using the floor today. All right, palms are facing inward and we're gonna only bend at those elbows, allowing the dumbbells to slowly come down into the elbows, get to a 90 degree angle, reverse direction, and back up. Really isolating your triceps on this one. And you're hitting 12 repetitions. Again, all the way up, all the way down. Concentrating on controlling the move throughout. Really trying to eliminate that momentum. We're gonna go back and forth between those biceps and triceps today while one's resting, the other's working, and vice versa. Halfway through. That's it, keep pushing, keep moving. Make sure to breathe in, inhale on the way down. Exhale as you push up through the hardest part of the movement. Good, good, good. Keep it up, everybody. Come on, focus on what motivates you, what brought you here today. So it's gonna get you through that burn. All right, here's your last one right here. And on the way up, we're gonna stop at that 90 degree angle and it's time to pulse. Again, like I said, very similar to that first move. If you need to change up your weight, feel free to do so. Little 15 second pulses, keep it up. Almost there, almost there. Three, two, one, and oh, hold. Oh, that's it. Whoo wee, you see I'm shaking too. That's it, keep those elbows bent at that 90. Fight through it, come on, we're almost there. 10 more seconds, guys. Come on, you got it, you got it. Don't quit, Five, don't quit. Four, three, two, one, Break. Excellent. All right, we're gonna go through that sequence <laughs> one more time. And I, I choose a little bit too much weight on that one, so I'm gonna mix it up and go a little bit lighter for my next one. And if you need to do so, feel free to mix it up. You'll see that anytime you need to make it heavier, make it lighter, just make this workout work for you and your fitness level. All right, we're getting back into it. Next set here, second and last one. In five, four, three, two, one, zero. That's it. Again, palms stay facing inward. Making sure to breathe in and breathe out. And yes, this is gonna totally annihilate those triceps, the back of your arms. That's on purpose. That burning sensation that you're feeling, that's how we know it's working. Halfway point. You gotta keep pushing through. When it gets tough, when the moves get tough, you need to be tougher. Remind yourself of what brought you here today. What was it that made you start this video, start this workout, hold on to it. It's what's gonna get you through, right here. Almost there. And last one. And let's pulse it. Nice little pulses. There we go, keep it going. Make sure to breathe. Come on, fighting through it, fighting through it. All right, guys, here we go in three, two, one, and hold. That's it, try to get your best to keep those elbows at a 90. We're right there with you, Has Fit Tribe. You can see Woo. me shaking, come on, let's go. Don't stop when it hurts, stop when you're done. Come on, finish strong, finish strong, there almost go, there. guys, in three, two, one, break. Woo, I felt that one, nice work. All right, we're going back to those biceps. We're gonna do a reverse curl variation. We have 20 repetitions in total, so choose your weight appropriately. Make sure to use those legs to help pick up the dumbbells and feet shoulder width apart. This time, our palms are gonna be facing us. Elbows are in, glued to our sides. With those wrists nice and straight, curl all the way up and all the way down. Keep the palms facing down. Elbows are in. We have five repetitions of this variation. Again, making sure to breathe. Staying under control. Excellent. Shoulders stay back. We have the last one right here. Last one. And then we're going to all the way down. Now we're going to go zero to 90 degrees times five. So that's one, two. So until that lower arm gets parallel to the ground, and then back down, that bottom half of the move. Last one. Right here. Now we're gonna go 90 to 180. All the way up. There it is, that burn's starting to kick in around that 10, 12 rep marker. Four, 
And five. Now we got all the way down, last five, all the way up, all the way down, full range of motion. Again, not rushing it. I know that burn's kicking in. You just want it to get over with. Three, four, and last one. Here it is. Boom. All right, set them down. Again, shake those arms loose. I'm feeling a good pump. How about you, Claudia? I'm feeling, I don't know what I'm feeling right now. I got a lot of emotions going on. <laughs> she's, got, she's got a lot of emotions. <laughs> Hopefully one of them is a good pump. All right. All right. We're going to break for just another five seconds here, and we're going to do this one more time. Let's get it going. Notice I had to drop my weights from the last couple of sets. That's okay. Yep. Adjust it accordingly. Elbows stay in, and let's hit it. Five repetitions. Nice full range of motion. This one's not only hitting your biceps, but your forearms as well. So if you're feeling a forearm and a grip burn, that's totally expected and okay. And last one. And all the way up, all the way down, and let's go zero to 95 times. Good. Try your best not to allow those elbows to flare out to the sides too much. Two more. Good. Let's hit it. Last Woo. one. And then 90 to 180. We're burning right there with you, Has Fit Tribe. Remember, hundreds, thousands, maybe even millions of us at home. Last one. Feeling that same burn you're feeling. Here we go. All the way back down. All the way up, all the Woo. way down. Last five. We're in it together, Has Fit Tribe. Let's go. Come on. Fighting through. Trying your best Three. not to swing those dumbbells. Four. Four. Last one. And five. Excellent job. You can set your dumbbells down for the next one, which is, I'm not sure if that's good or bad news in this case, but we're moving on to our <laughs> triceps. We're gonna do a body weight move. So let's move on to the floor. We're gonna start with five repetitions of a diamond push-up. And so we're gonna put our hands together in this shape here, forming a diamond. I'm gonna be up on my feet. And I'm gonna be down on my knees. And this is really gonna isolate those triceps. So elbows come out to the side and we're performing five repetitions with us now. Begin. And one, nice and controlled again, all the way up, all the way down. Do the best you can on these. It's a tough move. Good. One more. Full range. And now staying up, let's transfer to a close grip push-up. So not wide, but just hands in line with our chest. Elbows are gonna stay into our sides. Five push-ups. One. Two, good, elbows staying nice and close. Three, four, last one right here. And five, let's hold down at the bottom now, 15 seconds. Yes, there is another static hold here. Good, try best to keep those elbows in. Another tough one. Come on, let's go, what'd you come here for today? What is it, what's driving you? Three, two, one, break. Ah. Shake it loose. We're gonna do that one more time. And if this is taking you to your, <laughs> your breaking point, that's okay, give it your best. It's meant to totally burn you out. That's, that's by design. That's right, and you're gonna see me struggle as you probably just saw, but you know what? I'm here, I'm doing it. it. And we're all getting better together right there and with I'm you. And I'm in it with you. Speaking of which, time for round two. Back to the ground, let's get into that diamond shape. All working together, all getting better every repetition. Let's hit it. Three, two, one, begin. Again, doing your best to control that descent. We're breathing in on the way down, breathing out on the way up. Almost there. Last one. And now let's transition into that close grip push up. Hands in line with your chest. Here we go. Let's hit it. Come on. When the workout gets tough, you got to get tougher. Those who think they can and those who think they can't are both right. Which one are you today? Come on, make a decision. Let's hit it. Last one. Keep that core tight, back straight. Nice. Last one, down and hold, 15 seconds. That's it, right there. Core stays tight, working your abs, shoulders, chest, and of course your triceps. Hold, 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 hold it. Come on, don't give up. Almost there. Three, two, one, break. <laughs> I just wanted to push it for a little extra challenge. Show off? No. <laughs> 
All right, we have one last superset, and we're actually gonna go back and forth between your biceps and your triceps. We recommend choosing a little bit lighter weight for this one, just so you're prepared. We're gonna do three sets of each of these moves, starting with a dumbbell clutch curl. We're gonna do three sets of 15 of each move. Good posture, shoulders are back, palms are facing inward. Now we're gonna keep those palms facing in as we allow our elbows to come out to the side. Dumbbells together, all the way up all the way down again nice and controlled for 15 repetitions we're just doing a little burnout here a lot of repetitions at the end just going to finish off those arms getting a lot of work in in a short period of time today We've made it this far just keep fighting just keep moving you got it again breathing in on the way down and breathing out on the hardest part of the move as you curl those dumbbells up. Squeeze those dumbbells up at the top every time. We're almost there. Breathing in. You have two more. Here it is. And last one. All right, now you can choose to use the same weight or mix it up, but we're gonna go into an overhead tricep extension. Pop those dumbbells straight up overhead, trying your best to keep good posture, keep those elbows in as we lower the dumbbells and raise them back up, extending your arms straight up. Nice and controlled all the way up, all the way down for 15 reps. You got it right here, everybody. We're biting and burning with you. You got to keep moving. Focus on what brought you here today. Whether it's more toned arms, stronger arms, you're just trying to get better at life in general. Five more. Whatever it is, just stay focused on it. Almost there, fighting through that burn. Here we go, here we go. Come on, you got it. All day, you got Last it. Last one. Excellent, okay. Right back into the biceps now. Triceps oh, are resting. Gracious. Oh, here it is. <laughs> Clutch curl. Biceps are working now. Like I said, at any point in time, if you need to switch up your weight, either making it heavier or lighter, feel free to do so. You don't need our permission. Make this workout work for you. Again, squeeze those dumbbells up at the top, squeezing your biceps. Elbows come out to the side. You got it. Here we are. Every repetition, getting you just that much closer to the end and just that much closer to your goals. Five more. That's it. Come on. Fighting through. Made it this far. No giving up now. You got it. Come on. If you can do this, you can do anything. It's all about that mental toughness right here. Last one. Where are you at? All right. Let's nice. go, Hasfit Tribe. Let's get those triceps next. You know the drill. Pump them up. Overhead right into it. That's it. Biceps are work are resting while those triceps are working. Nice. Keep breathing. Whatever you do, do not hold your breath. All right. Third of the way through. That's it. Come on. <laughs> Just three sets of each of these, and your arms are done. Come on. That's it. Ooh, they're starting to get heavy. We're feeling it too. Five more. Come on, focus on what brought you here today. What is it? Come on, what's it gonna take to get there? Doing at least one thing every day to get you just Last that much one. closer. Come on, nah. one more of each. Oh, Come on, goodness gracious. Tribe. We got it, shake those arms loose. Let's go, come on. You got it, you got it, right here. These five pounders are starting to feel like 100, 30 pounds. 105? Yes. <laughs> come on, that's it. If you gotta switch to just using your arms or using some water bottles. Whatever you gotta do, just finish right here. Think about how good you're gonna feel when this workout is all done and you can cross this off your list. Think about what would happen if you just stopped working out and never worked out again. What would the consequences be of that? That's not something that you wanna move forward with. That's why you're here putting in the work. That's number 12 right there. That's it, 13, almost there, last two. 14, squeeze them. Last one, 15. Here we are, Whew. last set. Finishing strong, finishing together. Let's go, Hasfit Tribe. Come on. Ooh, those arms are getting more toned, more lean muscle with every rep. 
not all about vanity, but hey, I'd be remiss if I didn't remind you how good those arms are going to look in a tank top. Come on now. Let's hit it rep by rep. Getting that much closer. Keeping good posture. Full range of motion. Five more. Come on. Fighting through. Fighting through. Almost there. And two. One. Last one. Zero. Set oh. those dumbbells down. Workout complete. Nice job, everybody. Nice work. Ooh, high five to you out there. Jeez, if you can lift your arms, then yeah, that was a give rough us high a virtual. Five. Yeah, virtual high five. One of, <laughs> whew, one of those. Thank you so much for working out with us today. Please support our mission to keep these great workouts free by donating to our Patreon page, downloading our app, or by picking up one of our t-shirts or my new book, Stay Fit for Life. And if you enjoyed this workout routine with us today, we ask that you give this video a big thumbs up and hit that red subscribe button so that you never miss another new workout from HasFit. Again, thank you so much for joining us today. I'm Coach Kozak. And I'm Claudia. And we will see you at your next workout.